When we look at the great complexity and diversity of life, with the beauty of the stars above us, it is hard to believe that there could be one primary cause, that cause and effect is based upon. But that is exactly what this video puts forward, that everything is based on one universal geometrical process of energy exchange. This will be explained by physics representing a physical process in three-dimensional space. In this theory, nature is uniformed because whenever there is cause and effect, there is an exchange of photon energy. The photon energy oscillation or vibration only occurs once and then it is gone forever. But the process of energy exchange continues, forming what we see and feel as the continuum of time. At low temperature, the future is unfolding relative to the atoms of the periodic table with each new photon energy oscillation or vibration. This forms the movement of positive and negative charge relative to the structure of the atoms. At higher temperature, the atoms break up. But the same geometrical process continues with the future unfolding relative to plasma with charge being able to cover a large area of interstellar space. If we take an individual atom, there is no concept or flow of time for the subatomic particles within the atom. There is only the division of charge into three parts. In this theory, this is because the atom is a standing wave in three-dimensional space. The electron clouds of probability that surround the atom form an interactive process with the electromagnetic spectrum. When light waves come in contact with the electrons that surround the atom, it forms a photon-electron coupling or dipole moment. These photon energy oscillations are the primary cause of the ever-changing world of our everyday life that we measure as a period of time. Because the universe is never at absolute zero, there is always the spontaneous absorption and emission of light with the movement of positive and negative charge. At the most fundamental level, this is a process of continuous spherical symmetry forming and breaking. The electron is the most spherical object in the universe, and the future is unfolding with each photon-electron interaction. This process forms the spontaneous entropy or disorganization that we have in the second law of thermodynamics. It also forms the potential for ever greater symmetry formation that we have in the diversity and complexity of cell life. Photon energy is continuously cascading down from the Sun forming greater degrees of freedom for increasing entropy or disorganization with the built-in potential for ever greater symmetry formation. A good way to comprehend this is to look at the nature of water. The structure of the atoms within water is relative to positive and negative charge and forms a dipole moment that in this theory represents standing waves in time with hydrogen bonds continuously breaking and reforming with the exchange of photon energy with the future continuously unfolding relative to the atoms of the water. This process is based totally on cause and effect and just a change in environmental temperature can cause new processes of circle symmetry forming and breaking forming hexagon standing waves within the water. Once again this is based on the exchange of photon energy and the movement of charge. The great potential of this universal process can be seen here in one of its most simple and beautiful forms with infinite snowflake diversity forming out of hexagon six-fold symmetry. The potential for this symmetry was always there with an infinite number of line symmetries within a sphere that in this theory represents an infinite number of potential timelines. The surface of the sphere forms a dynamic boundary condition with the outer convex surface forming a geometrical reason for positive charge and the concaved inner surface forming negative charge. 
Each timeline will be at right angles to the surface of the sphere, representing electromagnetic field lines always being at right angles to each other. What we are seeing is the formation of electromagnetic fields relative to new photon oscillations or vibrations. At each photon-electron coupling or dipole moment, the profound symmetry between matter and antimatter is broken with the annihilation of antimatter. The annihilation of the antimatter represents the past with the emission of a new photon representing the future with Heisenberg's uncertainty principle representing the same uncertainty we have with any future event at the smallest scale of the creative process. This process of symmetry forming and breaking forms the potential for the complexity and diversity of cell life. If we take an individual cell we find the same process of energy exchange relative to the structure of the cell with the build-up of positive and negative charge across the membrane of the cell. The photon forms a movement of charge. Therefore, what we are seeing is the future unfolding with the exchange of photon energy with the movement of charge relative to each individual cell. In such a theory, the future is not based on total randomness. It is based on broken spherical symmetry and this takes the form of the most beautiful geometrical shape with the Fibonacci spiral being visible almost everywhere in nature. In this theory we see the Fibonacci spiral in plant life not because of economy of growth but because we have a universal process of symmetry forming and breaking. This is why the Fibonacci spiral can be seen in so many different ways that are totally unconnected this is a very beautiful example with a girl with wet hair flicking her head and as the water comes off her hair it forms a Fibonacci curve the connection with all these Fibonacci spirals and curves is that they were all formed over a period of time it is the continuum of space-time as a geometrical process of symmetry forming and breaking that forms a Fibonacci spiral this can also explain why these spirals are never perfect. It is because they are formed out of broken spherical symmetry relative to the atoms of the periodic table. At higher temperatures the atoms break up and the geometry of this process is extended over a much larger area in the form of plasma. This spherical geometry can actually be seen in these images from the International Space Station with a candle flame in zero gravity naturally forming a sphere that is interacting with the environment relative to the two-dimensional surface of the sphere. The great thing about a process of symmetry forming and breaking is that there is always the potential for ever greater symmetry formation. In this theory intelligent life represents the most advanced form of this process with all intelligent life having line symmetry or left and right handedness representing the timeline of the individual life form with each individual life form always in the moment of now in the center of their own reference frame being able to look back in time in all directions at the beauty of the stars Life is an integral part of this creative process with the wave-particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons forming a blank canvas that we can interact with forming the possible into the actual. This process gives us free will to choose if a potential photon remains a wave of probability or becomes a photon oscillation changing the future in the process. In this theory creation is truly in the eye and hand of the beholder. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share. It will help the promotion of this theory.